Under our Ship Rider program, ships and aircraft from the U.S. Coast Guard host law enforcement officers from Pacific Island nations to patrol their own maritime areas. The benefits can be significant. Since just 2009, for example, this program has helped Kiribati net more than $4 million in fines for illegal fishing. Now we're working to expand our ship rider partnerships to include the United States Navy in addition to the United States Coast Guard. This will allow countries to take advantage of U.S. Navy ships that are already in the region or are transiting through the region to get help enforcing their own laws. Additionally, we are working with Australia, New Zealand, and France to strengthen our Pacific Maritime Surveillance Partnership, which puts a particular focus on fisheries. All of these steps will help strengthen regional law enforcement and promote security with the goal of making sure that the people of the region benefit from your abundant ocean resources. That brings me to the second area I want to mention. Our work to reduce the number of unexploded bombs, shells, and other ordnance left over from World War II that unfortunately still litter the lands and waters of the region. I'm aware that no one knows the full extent of the problem, but we do recognize it is a crucial matter for security and prosperity. 